Good evening fishers, I've just whipped up a couple of rod holders. I like to beach fish and I, have, I really love rock fishing. Um, so what I've got here is an aluminium angle. I whipped out to Bunnings. Um, so basically let me run through you what we've got here. Um, Okay, so that's aluminium angle, 30 by 30 by 3 mil. Uh, that's a, I bought two one meter lengths. Um, they cost $14.40 each. And then I got uh, a meter piece of PVC pipe. I'll just check my docket. PVC pipe is pipe class 12. 40 millimeter inside diameter, 40 millimeter, and yeah, that was also a one meter length. So I'll just cut that in half. Uh, what else did I get? I uh, got M5 by 75 mil bolt, and then I got M5 lock nuts. And then I got the M5 washers were pretty small, so I bumped it up and went to the 6mm just so it's got a bit more surface area. Um, yeah, they do the job nicely. Once you've um, drilled it, you've got about, I don't know, 8mm sticking out of the thread, so I just got my hacksaw and lopped it off. Yeah, they're nylock, so now they're in there, they're not going anywhere. I just put a bit of electrical tape there and there, so when I was drilling the holes, the pipe, I didn't have to hang on to the pipe, the pipe was all lined up nicely. So, um, what did I do? I think I measure, measured 150 out the top there. And 30, 30 and 130 for the bottom holes. Okay, so that's that. Um, yeah, I, I, I like the aluminium because you can go on a rock and you should be able to find a crack to jam it into. Um, you know, because uh, what is there? It's only about an inch wide or something. You know, at its narrowest. I won't measure it, but anyways. I'll, um, yeah, so just take your time when you're drilling through this. This here, that's probably the hardest part. You want to drill the holes down into the V. Um, I started with a four mil bit to do my pilot holes. Yeah, so just do your these two holes from the inside to outside. Um, yeah, drill those and then take that on and then you can drill, oh yeah, drill your four mil, then drill your five mil, then tape it on and then drill your five mil all the way through. I had to stick the, um, the drill bit just in the tip of the you know, it was only in the drill about 10 mil to get all the way through. But anyways, it, it went through, it did the job. You're only drilling through plastic or PVC, so it wasn't too hard. All right, you could um, probably use wing nuts if you wanted to and take this off, but I don't like the idea of that. You don't want to drop a bloody wing nut down in the crack or it falls off while you're trekking through the bush. So this is, you know, pretty foolproof. I don't know how much it weigh, I reckon. Oh, it'd have to weigh no more than two kilos. Actually, I'll pause the video and I'll get a weight on it. Just hold on a moment. Okay, awesome. I'm not a very good human scale. Uh, it comes in around 700 grams a piece, so um, better than I expected. Awesome. Try and keep the weight down. So there's your part numbers if you need it. I'll try and hold still. 
So I worked out so 20 bucks for the batteries, disregard that obviously. So take 20 bucks off, so it was 47 bucks for the two items. Basically all I needed was a drill, a hacksaw, a file for taking off any sharp edges. I wish I took this sharp edge off before I taped it together. So just give that, consider that. Um, oh yeah, and down this end, I didn't want a sharp, sharp point just there, just while you're handling and carrying it. You know, I just thought, I can always make it sharper if I need to, but I just thought safety wise. And I like the angle of this one a bit better. This is the one I cut second, so just a bit of a steeper angle. Um, anyway, guys, hopefully, I know that it might inspire one of you, or give you an old idea, you know, to whip something up. Alright, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Cheers.